Thank you for coming. Thank you so much. And Senator Cruz, thank you, sir. Thank you so much. And we, we have a lot of elected officials here. I want to thank them as well for being here. God prepared me for this moment right here. And I'm going to tell y'all why. Because if anyone knows anything about me, then you're going to know I grew up in that little town called Wrightsville, Georgia. Because of the grace of God, I got a chance to win a Heisman Trophy. Because of the grace of God, I got to play 15 years in pro football. Because of the grace of God, I got a chance to be on the 1992 Olympics bobsled team. Tell I'm not a politician. I don't look like one, don't talk like one, don't act like one. I'm that warrior from God that he's been looking for. I'm that warrior from God he's been looking for. It don't matter what we are. It don't matter what we are, but what I do know we are, we're Americans. That's what matters, that we're all Americans, and that's what we need to get back to. We need to get back to, we need to get back to being an American rather than being something else. Because that's what they're trying to do. Divide it, that's divided when they're dividing you, that's how they conquer. But I want us to wake up to it. That's what you gotta do. You gotta get out and vote. You gotta get out and vote because you know he hung around, he hung around and got into this runoff. And he thinking he's going to win. We need to prove him wrong and let him get out of that office. He don't deserve to be in that office representing Georgia. Senator Cruz said we got to do something about it. I can promise you this. I'm not going to Washington to make friends. I'm going to Washington to do my job. That's what he should have done. I'm going to Washington to do my job. And that's what I'm going to Washington to do to protect my family. And all of you are my family. So I'm going to protect my family. And that's what I say I'm going to do. You know, we cannot continue to do this. We cannot continue to do this. I want everyone to call a friend and tell your friend to get out and vote. Tell your friend you got to go out and vote. Do not sit on the sideline no more. Because if we sit on the sideline, we will not recognize this country again. They want to change everything about this country. They want to change it. And I said right now we got the B team in. We got the B team in. It's time to put the A team in. It is time to put the A team in. And the way we can do it is December the 6th. December the 6th, we got to get out and vote. And tell your friends to get out and vote. This is the most important election of your lifetime. It's coming December the 6th.